Hey, welcome back to Kitchen Treks. I'm Tanby, and today we're making a dish from the Philippines called chicken adobo. Now, this is an immensely popular dish, but I've never had it before, so it's gonna be my first time making it. As I was researching recipes on how to make chicken adobo, I found that a lot of people put their own spin on things. Some people add lime zest and fish sauce or sake to the marinade. But at its core, this dish is browned meat, and in this case, chicken, with bay leaves, black peppercorn, a lot of garlic, and soy sauce, and vinegar. You can't forget the vinegar. Because the vinegar gives it that tangy flavor that I'm assuming is signature to chicken adobo. And you take that beautiful marinade and you serve it with steamed rice. That sounds delicious to me. Let's get started. So to start, we're gonna use bone-in, skin-on chicken thighs. That way you have super dark meat. And you're gonna start by heating up three tablespoons of canola or any other cooking oil on the stove. Definitely recommend a Dutch oven. Once the oil is heated, we're gonna put these chicken in skin side down. We're gonna let this chicken sear for three to five minutes. While this chicken is searing, it's the perfect time to make the marinade. To start the sauce, you're gonna add three fourths cup of soy sauce, half cup white vinegar, half cup water, three tablespoons of sugar, one third cup garlic, four bay leaves, it's like it's fall, and half a teaspoon of black pepper. You're gonna to wanna to mix this up until the sugar is dissolved. Now we're gonna flip the chicken over. Scoop up half of the chicken fat at this step. Once you've flipped the chicken over, you're going to add in your sauce. You're gonna bring this mixture up to a boil. It's been about 25 minutes, so now we're gonna check on our chicken. Hello. Oh my god, it looks so good. I'm gonna take a spoon and start spooning the brown sauce over the chicken. Some people add scallions and cilantro for color. The chicken is ready to serve. Look how brown and delicious it looks. Oh my God. Now that the chicken's done, you're gonna take a beautiful tender piece and just place it near your rice. 